I literally feel like a flight is had annual exits are here, here and here. I don't know why I did that. And then to fasten and then pull the strap. Not so high, sometimes you don't want to make such a statement. I like to make a statement in life, always. Listen, when you walk into a room, you need to own it. Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel and I hope you're all doing very well. So in today's video, I am bringing you another haul. I am getting a little bit obsessed with these hauls and I absolutely love filming them, so why not? I think they're a hit on my channel. So yeah, this could be my thing. I think I've found my niche. Buying clothes, trying them on, what's not to love? So as you can see by the thumbnail guys, I am bringing you a pretty little thing haul. This is not like a massive haul. It's not one of the biggest hauls um, that I've got to do. I think it's more shoes that I've got to show you than clothes. Um, but yeah, so if you are interested in watching this video, then please keep on watching. <laughs> can see I am doing a PLT haul and um, so like I said I've bought like more shoes than I have clothes and um, the thing is is like I try to like pick one place and then pick out the bits that I like I like to um, try and focus on like one shop but I just find that you can't find everything that you want so I end up like picking bits here and there so that's why all of these hauls are kind of like broken up but I thought I would just do a PLT one. I think it will get confusing if you buy like bits from here and there and all the links in the description box. I think it would just get so confusing. So to kick things off, I think I'm just going to show you all the shoes that I've bought first. Um, and then I'll pair them with the things that I only like the few pieces that I've got. I've got six pairs of new shoes that I picked up. I haven't really got any like summer stuff. And I was just like, I really need like mules and sandals and never say no to another pair of trainers um so yeah i am going to show you all the shoes that i've got and then i will um, match them with the outfits so to start off with i am just going to read them off my phone to let you know what they are to start off with i'm going to be showing you the nude plated square toe high heel mew and i absolutely love this i think it's so cute these were £12, which is like amazing. Um, I use, so Pretty Little Thing I've always got sales on. I mean, now it says on here, summer sale up to 70% off. Code extra to get 10% off, which I always do. Um, and it really brings down the prices of everything. So literally, I picked these up for £12. So I'm just going to show you. Ta-da! Shoe number one. So I went in, I'm just going to place these on here. So these are the shoes, as you can see. I'm literally just going to come closer so you can see the detail. And then I will put the um, image up on screen for you. Um, but this is what they look like. I am literally obsessed with these shoes. So it's like a squared off back bit here, as you can see. And then you've got your heel. It's not too high, which is really good. They also packed a spare pair of these because, you know, like... If you get them stuck anywhere, you know that you've got replaceables. Um, it's not too high. I really like it. I think it's really different because it's got like this squared finish, whereas normally it's like rounded. Um, and then it's got this like crisscross um, pattern. So yeah, absolutely lovely. I think they're lovely. I think they're really, I've tried them on. They're really comfortable. Um, it's not too high. You can literally dress this up. And dress it down i would wear this with like maybe like an oversized top um you can wear this with dresses like long t-shirt dresses or long shirt dresses anything you really want jeans um i just really loved it i love the fact that it was just not so high sometimes you don't want to make such a statement I like to make a statement in life always listen when you walk into a room you need to own it but not all the time you want such a heavy cluttered heel if that makes any sense um so i picked up those absolutely love these i love the color of nudes in shoes um it's just amazing and with like white toes and a tan it's just life it really really is 
So they were those shoes, love them. Next in, I picked up a cream plated strap mule sandal. So these ones are like a flat white sandal. When I saw these, they were so pretty. I literally love them. I literally think of like holiday with these and like a really nice dress during the day because I don't wear sandals in the evenings at night. I really love to get dressed up on holiday, but other people just like to chill and when they go on holiday, they don't want to get dressed up and that's absolutely fine. Um, but this is a kind of sandal that I would wear if I was going out during the day venturing out um they're just so pretty and they've got such a nice detail to them um so these were 15 pounds um, shoe number two and these are the shoes now I literally am obsessed with these they are so pretty they've got like this cross stitch if that's what you would call it um, in gold and white and then the actual shoe is like beige it's really nice it's a flat shoe as you can see and it's just the detailing is just so minor but it's so effective and um, all the pictures will go above so you can see um, more clearly um, but yeah, absolutely love this. Again, like I said, you can wear this with like a t-shirt dress, a shirt dress, you can wear this with jeans. Um, but I really feel like on holiday, this is like such a holiday vibe. Um, you can literally like wear this with anything. Like I said, you know when you're going to visit the cities, um, that's when you want to wear flat shoes because you, you tend to like walk a lot. Um, you want something a bit dressy but not too dressy, something stable for when you walk in so you don't go arse over tip because there's just nothing worse. I mean, even when you're abroad, like it's just even more embarrassing when you fall over. I mean, it's probably better because nobody knows you, but it's just like you're definitely going to make a statement then. Um, so something sensible is definitely a pair like this. Um, again, they're really comfortable. I mean, the only thing is, is that they're really flat. Sometimes people cannot wear completely flat shoes. It can bother your back if you're used to wearing heels. So sometimes it's nice that if you do want to go flat, you wear just a tiny heel. This doesn't really have that. You can't class this as a heel. Um, but yeah, that's those. Absolutely love these. Da da. Are they on the right foot? No. Da da. Yeah, absolutely love these. These are gorgeous. Okay, next in, we are going in with a right croc PU strap over flat sandal. Why can't they just call it a white croc sandal? I mean, why do they need to call it that? That is like so extra. Why Why can't they just call it a white croc sandal? Why is it white croc PU strap over flat sandal? <laughs> Moving on. So these cost £13, which I absolutely loved. I mean, all the shoes that I picked up were like really reasonable in price. I mean, I'm going to pay more. And I'll tell you why. Because nine times out of ten, you only use these shoes for a year, for like one holiday. Or you may use them now and again, but they don't last that long. So you don't want to be paying so much. And I just find that you change your sense of style every year anyway. So this is perfect pricing if you're one of me, if you're like me where you, you just want to mix it up like all the time. Um, so yeah, I will grab those for you now. Next. So, these are the bomb. I absolutely love how different these are. So, this is the shoe here. So, you've got like a white detailing here with the gold. Um, and it's almost like tile effect, if that makes any. I'm not very good at describing clothes. You can tell like I'm not like some fashionista. Um, but it's not like a squarey tile thing. And then you've got the same um, detail going on the front of the shoe as well. So it's this very thick, stable, white um, strap that you've got. Um, it's very simple. I love the fact that the actual base is like a brown as well. I think the brown and the white go really well together. Um, so this is the shoe. Again, you can pair this with whatever you want to. All the shoes that I've bought, you can literally do what you want with them. Jeans oversized shirts i sound like i'm repeating myself but this is like the fashion you know nowadays they're um, just such a lovely pair of shoes like i absolutely love these like what more could you ask for they're just stunning 
they really are so i picked up those so next in i was really worried about these shoes only because like to me they're like i was worried that they were like stripper shoes and there's no disrespect to stripper shoes but it's you know um so i have picked myself up a clear block heel twin strap sandal now when i saw it i was like do you know what i actually really really like them so i picked them up they were 25 pounds so everything that i used was in the sale um and i'm sure it will work out the same price i mean plt is always on sale and when you use code extra you always get the extra 10 percent off um so yeah i picked up these shoes and i was like really worried i was like oh are they gonna make me look too like i should be in a strip club basically really like them they go so well with like an outfit where you don't want like such a harsh color on your feet and this if you're like wearing like a really dressy dress your makeup's really done well your hair's done well and you don't want too much going on your feet these are the ones these these are quite something these are these are the ones so this is the shoe as you can see so this is the glass heel it is completely like rounded um and then it's completely like a square glass and then you've got your clear um strap here and then you've got like a strap at the front i have put these on and they are not bad i mean what high heel is comfortable like two pairs of high heels that are the most comfortable high heels i've ever had um but these are not bad and i really love these they are so nice you can see that's the full length of the shoe so i absolutely love these um i know there is i, I bet there is a lot of people that wouldn't wear this necessary or would wear it um, but yeah, I really like them, I'm not going to lie. Like, normally I wouldn't go for things like this, but I was like, do you know what? I really like this. So, that's them. Moving on to the last pair of shoes. I'm a bit shoe mad. Um, I went in and picked up a white flat form chunky high car trainer boot they cost me 30 pounds so i think they're originally like 35 without the um sale i absolutely love these again i'm really fussy when it comes to trainers and i've really gotten into this like chunky vibe so i've got like the tall ones i think you guys if you see my instagram and um, i'll put a picture on now for you i'm really into these tall chunky ones but i wanted a low pair so they're not so high and these were perfect so i'm going to show you now I'm just going to pick them up so it's this here and them and then yeah this is the trainer i am literally i'm literally obsessed with these they are perfect because the ones that i've got in the picture you'll see again now is they're like really tall they're like high top chunky trainers whereas this ones they are low but they've still got like that chunk detail going on love the silver um brooch bit for the laces that's really cool as you can see and they are true to their size pretty little thing um so yeah so that is them and then you've got the laces there i just love these i'm obsessed with them i just love a good chunky trainer i'll never say no to it i think it just goes such a good vibe and such good fashion style when you're wearing like long t-shirt dresses or like shirt dresses mate they're the bomb with a long sleek ponytail this is your aunt. So that is all the shoes that I picked up from PLT. So now I'm going to move on and just show you the pieces that I've got. I've literally only got this one that I'm wearing. Um, I've only got like three, four pieces to show you, but I just wanted to show you them anyway. Um, so to kick things off, I'm going to talk to you about what I'm wearing now. So I am obsessed with this. This is, is the Khaki Cargo Oversized pop up front shirt dress um so this is i think part of the money may collection because she is wearing it i also wanted to pick this up in the cream but they sold out i was devastated and um, because this i've got it on now and the material is just so thick it is beautiful um this cost me 22 pounds um she's also wearing a green bell that i picked up to go with it which is 
this here i picked up the green belt that she was wearing in the picture as well you can get these in so many different colors i've also picked it up in black to go with my other outfit that i will show you it is literally just a simple buckle um that looks like this do you know what i feel like a flight attendant i literally feel like a flight attendant and your exits are here here and here I don't know why I did that and then to fasten and then pull the strap so yeah I picked up this belt it looks like this you can pick it up in so many different colors this cost me where are we so these belts are seven pounds and they're called the slider buckle tape belt so like i said i picked them up one in black and one in khaki uh, green and again i think they do them in so many different colors so this is the top half of the oversized shirt so it's got two pockets here um as you can see and they're actually pockets it's got these gorgeous silver really thick buttons um and i and they match and then they're the same on the calves. I absolutely love how thick this material is. It is beautiful. Um, it's just stunning. You can wear this with chunky trainers or the clear heels that I've got if you want to dress it up. You can wear it with flats. You can do what you like. What I'm going to do is I think I'm going to pair it with the chunky trainer so you can get that vibe. And then I'm also going to pair it with the clear heel so you get that vibe as well. Um, so yeah, I will be right back. So this is the belt and the oversized t-shirt in full view. As you can see, I am literally obsessed with this look. I just think it's such lovely quality. I have the clear heels on as you can see and I think it just gives it such a lovely vibe. I am just living for this look. You can see I have got the khaki belt attached to the oversized shirt and I just think it really finishes off the look. Just got a nice little black bag just to show you the full length view of how this look can be finished. Then I wanted to show you what the look looks like if you was to pair it with a chunky heel and this is the result that you would get. I think this looks really really cool with a nice trainer. If you wanted to just dress it down without the heels this is the look that you're going to get. Okay, so this is the oversized t-shirt on. Now, I absolutely love it. It fits really well. It's not too um, huggy, so I don't have to go a size up. I mean, I could go a size up if I wanted it a little bit looser, um, but I can always just buy another one. So one's in a wash and then I've got another one. Um, I will say that this is a bit too short, I think, to pull off just for a t-shirt dress. I mean, if you are walking around at home and maybe if you do only wear flats with this, you might just get away with it but i think this with a cycle short would look better um so i'm going to show you now what, what i mean so this is what it looks like for you now if i was to turn around you will understand what i mean when i say that i think it's a bit too short to be wearing as a t-shirt dress or it might not be Da -da. i mean if you're gonna bend over everyone's gonna see anything and that is not gonna be a good look and if you haven't shaved that's gonna be even worse of a look um so at the front it looks okay with a <laughs> at the front it looks okay but i think something like this with the cycle short is going to look way better um i'm gonna put a heel on just to show you what it would be like um if you were to try and use this as just like a t-shirt dress and then i will put the cycling shorts on for you and show you a look now this is with the cycling shorts on now i am so happy with these cycling shorts i have got the clear heel on as well and um, just so you can see but these shorts are amazing they have literally gone up high waisted so they are literally like sucking me in which is just amazing so they suck you in really well and they are just such a lovely finish they are really figure hugging i think they're really flattering and yeah it just literally finishes the look off i mean you don't have to wear it with heels i'm literally going to put a chunky trainer on to show you guys what it looks like 
Um, but yeah, I'm literally living for this khaki green oversized t-shirt and these black cycling shorts. I absolutely would recommend. I was really worried about these cycling shorts because I thought they weren't really going to grip. But they really grip and they're just a nice finish. They're very thick material as well. So they're not thin. They're not going to be see-through. No one's going to see your knickers, which is just like the worst look ever. I hate things that are see-through. I cannot stress to you how much I hate it. And then this is the look with trainers, which I'm just literally obsessed with. They look so thick. I love this look if you're literally going food shopping, if you're just literally going out to do errands, you want to look trendy, you want to look sassy, you want to look on fleek, this is your look. Okay, and moving on to the last piece, like I said, I didn't pick up um, a lot, it was like mainly shoes. Um, but I have to say, this PLT order did not go swimmingly. So first I paid for next day delivery and it came like two days later, which I'm absolutely fine with. I'm not going to bash on that. They are so stretched, I get it, which is absolutely fine. But it is annoying when you pay for next day. But anyways, they refunded it and it's all good. Then I get my order and then one of my belts was missing so then they had to resend that out and then I got the wrong top but the label was meant to have the top on. So basically I picked up this oversized t-shirt which I absolutely love and it says on there am I enough. Um, and the quality is really thick like I didn't realize that it was going to be this thick which I'm so happy about but what I ended up getting instead was this plain really thin t-shirt really long with a split up the front and it says on the label that this is the white am I enough oversized dress and like this is the one that I got and it is like so see-through and I was just like oh no these are like one of these oversized t-shirts you don't wear because you will see nipples, everything that you don't want to see. Even though when you're wearing a bra, like you literally will see everything. This is something that you wear when you just come out of the water and you just bung this on to go have some lunch, like a cash pan. So this came, so I was like, oh my, what is happening? But I finally got the actual product that I was meant to get. So this is the t-shirt dress, am I enough, oversized, and I picked this up in a 12, and it is this gorgeous dress here. The quality of it is really thick, and I can see that it's really good material, which I'm so happy for. Again, it's not gonna be see-through. Don't love that look, don't rate it, hate it, goodbye, au revoir. Um, and yeah, so I picked this up, and I just literally love the saying, am I enough, though? Like, it's just like the best saying ever. Um, you know, when you just can't please people, just wear this and be like, am I enough though? You know, like, I just, I love it. Um, so with that, I saw the model wear the um, black um, tape belt again. So I picked myself up a black one um, to put around this. I think it's gonna accentuate um, the waist again. It's gonna look really nice. Um, so I'm gonna pair that with that. And then again, you can wear this. This is going to look so good. Um, you can wear it with cycling shorts, but I think this dress is long enough and you won't see the cycling shorts, so that won't be a vibe. Um, I mean, you can do it if you don't want to get the thigh rub or you just want that peace of mind. Um, but this is long enough to just wear it as a t-shirt dress. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna put this with a heel so you can see again, and I will put this with a chunky trainer and I shall be right back. So this is the look. Now ignore the top half because I've managed to get makeup on well done. It was either this hairpiece goes flying or this gets makeup on it and yeah, it's a good job I'm keeping it. Um, so this is the look and I'm literally obsessed with this dress. It is so, comfortable it is really thick in material it's fantastic the belt really finishes it off because it is quite baggy um, and if you want some shape with this outfit this is going to finish it off just paired it with my heels and a black bag and yeah i'm literally living for this look and then everyone this is what it looks like with a trainer on again i'm literally obsessed with this look 
it is such a vibe i am just living for it these chunky trainers really do finish off the look and you can still look dressed up smart elegant and sassy even with a trainer on so everyone that is the end of the haul i hope you've enjoyed this as much as i love filming these i know i didn't get a lot of pieces but like i said it was like more shoes and um, but i still wanted to jump on and show you some looks i definitely want to pick this up in a cream love this so much this is like one of my favorites again with like this top i just to be honest i just love it all i think they're all lovely in their own way i'm literally obsessed with them um so yeah i will leave all the items in the description box below for you don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up go and hit that subscribe button it will help me out loads i will really appreciate it we are slowly getting there. We're slowly climbing up with the numbers. And yeah, leave your comments in the description box below. And yeah, guys, until the next one, take care. Bye.